is Father Ian Duffy, and I'm the rector of the Basilica of Our Lady Immaculate. For those of you who don't know, that's the great big church on the hill downtown. It is a real pleasure to be with you here during the month of June. Now, I know for most kids in school, it certainly was when I was in school, the month of June is a very exciting month because it means that summer holidays are just around the corner. And generally, June also, in normal times, means things like class trips and class parties, the end of school, all kinds of things like that, all of which are, are very important and they're a load of fun. But it's also important, and that's why I'm here today with you, to remember that for us as Catholics and for many other Christians, the month of June is also the month dedicated to the Sacred Heart of Jesus. Just like the month of May is dedicated to our Blessed Mother, Mary, the Mother of Jesus and our Mother, so the month of June is dedicated to the Sacred Heart of Jesus. Now, the Sacred Heart, when we talk about that, what are we talking about? Well, obviously, we aren't talking about worshipping a part of the body. A good way to understand the, the devotion to the Sacred Heart of Jesus is to think about what happens on Valentine's Day. When you get a Valentine's card, or when you give a card, what shape is it often in? It's in the shape of a heart. And we know that the heart is a symbol of love. And that is exactly what the Sacred Heart of Jesus is. It is a great symbol of Jesus' love for each and every one of us. When we look at pictures of the Sacred Heart, we often see the heart of Jesus sometimes popping right out of his chest. And it's sometimes surrounded by a crown of thorns, the crown of thorns that he wore on the cross when he showed the extent of his love for us by suffering and dying for us. Sometimes it'll have flames coming out of the top of the heart. And that represents that Jesus' heart is on fire with love for us. That his love isn't just a thought that he has every now and then. His love isn't just an idea, but that his love is burning. That he loves us so much that his heart is on fire with love for us. Now, the other important thing to remember about the Sacred Heart of Jesus is that we don't have to do anything to earn that love the love that comes from the Sacred Heart. The whole message of the Sacred Heart of Jesus is that Jesus loves each and every one of us exactly as we are. Mother Teresa once said, you do not need to change to believe in my love because it is my love that will change you. When we invite the love of Jesus into our hearts in a very particular way, by praying to the Sacred Heart of Jesus, then that love has the power to transform us into more loving, more caring, more compassionate people, into people who are more like Jesus himself. The Sacred Heart of Jesus is a wonderful devotion any time of the year, but in June, we focus in a particular way. We dedicate the whole month to the Sacred Heart of Jesus. And I'd like to close by sharing with you a prayer for the Sacred Heart of Jesus. O Almighty and Eternal God, look upon the heart of your dearly beloved Son and upon the praise and satisfaction that he offers to you on behalf of us. And being pleased with his offering, Grant pardon to those who seek your mercy. In the name of this same Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God forever and ever. The Lord be with you. And may the blessing of Almighty God, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit descend upon you and remain among you always. God bless you all and may the heart of Jesus fill you all with his love.